Hey y'all, I'm Shamar and I'm here with my girl Sabrina and we are Holly You Reviews. Two Americans who are swept up in the Korean wave as it reaches across the globe. We have a love of all Korean music. We're reacting to Big Bang's Oh My Friend from the live 2009 Big Show. It says it's featuring No Brain which I think I read is supposed to be a pop runk Korean band. Pop punk. Pop punk, what did <laughs> I say? I don't even want to know. <laughs> pop runk. <laughs> which feels oddly applicable. I'm not, not really sure why, having not ever heard this song or seen the video, but... Um, we were having a really difficult, <laughs> really time hard time trying to research find this one. In, yeah, finding any sort of information on this song. So I'm hoping that it's not going to be a bust for us. We've had a few of those tonight. Um, but it sounds like from what the viewers you have, have these said. too. <laughs> <laughs> Sabrina can't make drinks for y'all at all. Ever. I've already said that. I got carried away. I thought it was pink lemonade. <laughs> anyway, um, the viewer said that this is their most like rock song sounding ish um, song. So let's I'm go. I'm excited. Ahead. Let's take it because you said you haven't heard it yet, right? I don't is, think so. And this it came out in around 2008. So I mean, that jives with 2009. So mm -hmm. all right, let's take a listen. From this third mini album. Oh, it already sounds rock, yeah. Is that Day on the drum? No. Okay. No, is that? Drum. This is written by G Dragon and No Brain. And No Brain. Which I guess is one person. I thought it was a group. I think it is a group. Why is it like wet in the face? Like, did you get sprayed or something? I mean, it's just or hard sweat. To spray it. Not my favorite genre for them. His vocal range on that. Yeah, it's not like a straining. Mm -hmm. They don't look so put together. I don't think I've seen any of the brain though yet. Is he part of the performance or just help? Uh, is it song? featuring the brain? Oh, sure did, so. Yeah. Maybe that's who's on the drum. Because they keep showing the drummer. Maybe. Maybe those are the music artists? Yeah, the official band. The band.
final thoughts. Great song. Still not my favorite of Big Bang. Not my favorite, it yeah. It definitely still has that high energy, though, that we love of Big Bang and we've come to expect. Um, I do think that it was a little out of G-Dragon's vocal range in terms of what he was trying to sing. Yeah. Yeah, the fans were definitely into it, but it seems like um, fans of K-pop groups might be into no matter what their artists sing, so that might not be the, the most telling litmus test for whether a song is great or not. But, yeah, I mean, I have so many questions who was the brain? I mean, were they, or no brain, or whatever it was called. No brain. Where was the brain? Were they the, the, musicians, the musicians, like you said? I just, is that the, really the only rock song that we've heard from them? I know we've done a, like a semi rock with Day Song, but like, I don't really, like, rock isn't what I think of when I think of Big Bang, Big Bang. which, you know, I mean, expand your horizons. I'm all for that, but it didn't, it seemed like you said, like, the G Dragon was really like straining. It wasn't really in his vocal range. Rock does, it can seem like a lot of screaming, which is not, I don't really think that that fits kind of their style. And there was a little bit of rapping, but there wasn't a lot of rapping. I mean, it, it didn't have like yeah. the ballad y sort of like singing. So I would consider this one a little bit of a miss for Big Bang, me personally. Just. It didn't seem like it was a good fit for for them and for their style. Like it was probably one of those things where like, yay, let's like write a song together. But then the reality of it, it just didn't quite mesh as well as maybe they thought it would. Me personally. I mean, what did you guys think? Make sure you let us know down in the comments section. Are we completely off or where if you recommended this, where you were going with this? This was of your I would love to see more, I guess footage of them doing this because it seems like there's not really a lot of footage of them doing this particular song so they must not have included it in lots of their other concerts i mean they've done several concerts since then since big show, um, yeah. since big show and this doesn't seem to come up as frequently as some of our others and so i'm wondering if, true, if yeah. this is one that they maybe drop from their set list it makes and if sense. So, yeah. I mean, that makes sense. It's kind of telling, but yeah, absolutely. I would like to see something where they they. I mean, this came out. What did we say, two thousand eight? Uh, I think that's what we said. Yeah, and they I mean, started. I mean, they started in two thousand six. The recording was two thousand nine. Yes, and so that was three years in. I mean, I would like to see something maybe like two thousand twelve, where they're still doing this particular song and seeing. If there's growth in their vocal range and their vocal performance from them. Yeah, agreed. So, I mean, we love everything from Big Bang, but this just definitely do. wasn't our favorite. And having not heard of No Brain, I'm wondering if they maybe fall in a genre that's a little bit outside of what Big Bang typically leans towards. So... Uh, let us know what you think. If there's more direction, maybe something that gives us a little bit more uh, clarity on this particular collaboration. We love collab collaborations in general, oh, yeah. but um, it, it has to fit both artists. I feel like if you have more information on who No Brain is, I don't. We, like I said, there was very limited information on this particular song. True. So, so, and if you like drama, make sure you check out our Halley Reviews website where we tell you which dramas to watch, must watch, or completely skip. That's right. And until next time. Until next time, y'all. I'm young. young.